Hey everybody, this is Brenda with Two Peas in a Pod. Today I'd like to share with you a couple of journals um, I've work, been working on. And I'm going to be putting them in my Etsy shop. But I wanted to share with you um, what, what they are. Um, I think I shared some pictures of this one. But anyway, it's a small, it is three and a half by four and a half. And it is one and a half inch spine. So three and a half by four and a half with a one inch spine, one and a half inch spine. But I did it in the black and white colors and um, with accents of pink. So it has a tie closure, a little flower that I made with um, couple of doilies and a sticker and some I put some uh, cheesecloth pink cheesecloth behind it and some trim uh, around the edge there and th it's got uh, five signatures and there's the back it's a plain back I just have the trim on the edge but um, and then it has the tassel on the side but um, this is um, a digital kit, and it was a black and white digital kit by um, TLC Vintage Creations. And um, so this was a challenge of hers to do something using the black and white digital kit. So it's got... Um, different pages, got a... Got a little clip there. And a lot of places to write. And then this is a butterfly rub on. But yeah, you can see the, the uh, signatures, five signatures. But it's got really pretty uh, nature flowers and birds. Uh, theme. I can't remember the name of it. The name of the, I should have wrote it down before I got on here, but I didn't. And there's another rub on. Memories to treasure. And then I put some little lace tabs. Anyway, it's just got, there's a black and white grid. And there's some more birds. Another flowers, and there's some more rub ons. Best day ever, and then a little flower on the end there on the corner. And then that one, but yeah, it has. And there's another um, altered paper clip, but it has lots of places to journal. This would be really nice to stick in your purse to carry with you. To jot down some notes or addresses or whatever. Anything, really. But I, I didn't do a whole lot of embellishing because it's a small journal. And and I want it to be a, that you can just throw it in your purse and not have so much embellishments going on. But there's another rub on. Social calendar and good times. But yeah. But anyway, so that's this journal. And then it has a pocket there for the tag. And there's the front. The front has a pocket with a tag also. But it's very nice, very neatly done. This is actually one of the neatest. I haven't done too many journals, but this is one of the neatest ones that has turned out for me. And I, I love the way. And now I've got some dangles with the um, made cute little dangles for the strings. So that's that one. And it's listed in my Etsy shop, and it will be listed under uh, Black and White Journal. So that's that one. 
And the next one is from a kit um, from uh, Newbie Junk Journal Makers, which is um, Melody Made. Dot com. She has digital, and this dig this kit was done with the digital kit called uh, "Spring Is in the Air." But this has a tie closure also, and this is uh, the cover is made with um, flower the flower sack material, and I added a butterfly and a pink doily, and this is. Um, one of the digitals from the kit but that's the front of it let me bring it back so you see if you can see it that's the front it's a soft cover and it has cardstock in between the two the two materials it's got a pink material and then the flower sack material and then it has a doily And that covers up your signatures. This is one signature. And um, and it has a string tassel with a little flower charm hanging. So there's, it has the tassel. The tassel is as long as the book. And uh, let's see if I can open it up and show you what's inside. Okay, this is one of the envelopes that comes in the kit. Bloom where you are planted, and I just added a button and some and some little uh, scraps that I had on my desk. And it's coffee dyed paper, and I uh, dis I distressed the edges. And there's uh, part of the kit. So anyway, the the digital kit that this is is uh, spring is in the air, and that's. Uh, with Melody Made. Okay, and there's another envelope that has come undone, but I have a tag in it. And the tags are made by the kit, too. So that's an envelope with the kit. And there's two tags that I altered that comes in the kit. Let me just set that aside. But anyway... Got lots of coffee. It's only one signature. One signature. And I want to uh, say there's like 40, 42 pages front and back. Anyway, there's a pocket in the front with another element of the uh, kit. The pocket and this is an element. And this can be, you can write a, if you purchase it, you can write a, a a uh, note to the one that's getting it. There's a background paper from the kit. But there's a background. There's a page from the kit. Like I said, coffee dyed paper. Um, I've got little little tabs. Little tabs made with uh, some more of the fabric that the cover's made with. And there's another digital. And there's another digital. More coffee dyed paper. And there's another digital sheet with a pocket and a couple more tags in the pocket. No, another digital sheet with a fabric tab. And this is another element. I put this in with the washi tape. And so it's just in there with, it's an add-on. It's, an add uh, it's not um, sewn into the signature. It's just an add-on. It's from the digital kit, but it's just an add-on with washi tape. More coffee dyed paper. And there's another background sheet of the digital. And there's another sheet from the digital with lines so it can be written on. And this is a little fold-out little pocket that I made with uh, an old book page. My granddaughter showed me how to make that. And she uh, she calls me Nani. She says, Nani, are you going to put it in one of your, one of your um, um, 
journals. And I said, I sure am. And I said, now I'm going to tell the ladies, too, that you showed me how to make that. But I thought it was real cute to tuck a little surprise in there. And I, I added the little doily and some buttons. But she was thrilled to know that I used it in one of my journals. And there's another envelope from the kit. And another tag from the kit that I just put a butter button in the center. And there's another double page. Just the center. there's another pocket with another tag. So lots of place lots of places to um journal or take notes or use as your Bible uh, journal. That's what I do with one of mine. Um, I take notes from church. When I go to church, I'll just take notes. And then if I come across a scripture I like, I'll write it in there. But anyway, a journal you can use for anything. There's another digital sheet. I mean, you name it. You can keep one in your purse for uh, jotting down memories uh, along the day, or you can uh, use it in your purse to, um, if you come across an idea that you want to try when you get home. There you go. But journals are endless of what you can do, do in them. But and here's an altered envelope that I did that I used some of the paper from the kit. I just took an old envelope and altered it. And then I um, added a tag. I'm not very good at holding something. And, but there's a, a index card that I just uh, made a little, uh, little scrappy thing and I just pinned it on with the, the pen. So that goes in there. There's another sheet with the bees on it. And there's another one of those pockets that my granddaughter showed me how to make. So you can add little goodies in there. See, it's got enough room in there that you can add some little something in there. Um, and then there's the back. And um, like I said, it's a soft cover. It's two materials with cardstock in between. And the size of this is five and a half by nine and a half. Five and a half by nine and a half. That's the size the journal is. But I wanted to let you know that I have been working on some things. Um, I'm slow, but I'm getting there. But I wanted to share with you all um, these journals. And uh, like I said, I will be putting them in my Etsy shop. And it's um, Two Peas in a Pod by Brenda is the name of, of my Etsy shop. And I will put the link down below. So thank you all for tuning in and, and uh, giving me a little bit of your time. And I thank you for all the new subscribers. I'm growing every day. I'm growing a little bit by little bit, and I thank you all, and I, I appreciate all the love and support you all have given me, and um, you all have a good uh, day, or I should say night, because it's night here now, but have a good night, and have a great rest of the week, and I will catch you all another day. Bye for now.